So now let's say you need a cabbage. We can get some blood vessels from a cabbage or coronary artery bypass grafting. We can get some blood vessels from underneath the breastbone, but one of the stalwarts, one of the main vessels that we use is the saphenous vein, which runs up and down the inside of your leg. Now you used to see people with a big incision over that entire vein up and down the inside of the leg. The saphenous vein is still a wonderful conduit and we use it all the time, but that incision caused some trouble. One, it was a long incision and it was uncomfortable. Sometimes it was more uncomfortable than the chest incision. Um, and two, sometimes that's a little bit harder for people to heal, especially if they have vascular disease. And three, it just didn't look great. So we've addressed all of those issues. Now we put an incision about that big um, behind the knee. And with instruments, we still take out that same piece of saphenous vein, which can be you know, a significant length, but we do that all underneath the skin. It's still a little bit sore, because like, it's still healing tissue, and there's still a little bit of a bruise under there. But once everything is healed, you end up with this incision that big underneath the skin, or underneath behind the knee. It's a lot more comfortable. Um, and it looks a lot better. So you can wear shorts and not have everybody know that people have been into your legs taking your vein.